Hey guys, welcome back. This is Ajax G here with another video. So I want to say thank you to my subscribers and thank you to those who are here for the first time. We are at 400 subscribers, so you know what that means. That means giveaway time, okay? Stick around in the video so you can know all the instructions for the giveaway. And let's get into this. So I'm going to talk about three laptops today. Two of them which are going to be under $500, including the upgrades that I'm going to talk about. These are going to be great options for those of you who are, you know, on a budget right now, especially in these times of the world, and you want to get a laptop and you want to start streaming or producing YouTube content because you're home and you either can't go to work, you know, don't really have to go to school all day, and or you just want to start up your channel. So the first laptop that we're going to talk about is the HP laptop, okay? It is an AMD A9 series, 4 gigabytes of memory, and it has a Radeon R5 graphics, okay? This is an APU, so it's included on the CPU, okay? Um, it has 128 gigabytes of solid state drive, okay? It is $300. I know you guys are probably thinking, Ajax, why would you suggest a $300 laptop? It's not going to perform the way I want it to. I'm telling you, it is. If you are going to be streaming from a console, so if you need a laptop to use an Elgato to stream through a laptop so you can, you know, have your Streamlabs open or your OBS, whatever you use, this is the laptop that you can use. It starts with four gigabytes of RAM. This laptop can actually hold 32 gigabytes of RAM, okay? It is a dual core um, CPU, so that is perfectly fine. It fits the specs that you need for Elgato, okay? It has an Ethernet port, okay? It's actually flat on the com computer, so there's like a little flap that you can put down and plug in. So it doesn't make the laptop really bulky, okay? Now, the reason why I'm showing this is because you can add um, RAM to this to make it to the performance that you need. You really typically need eight gigabytes of RAM, but I always recommend 16, so you can kind of future-proof this laptop, okay? This is going to be able to last you for at least two years. Now, if you're someone that can put Linux on it as well, I would recommend putting Linux on it. Now, for two four sticks of RAM to make it eight gigabyte, it's going to run you like 30 bucks, that's it, off of Amazon. But as I said, I recommend putting 16 gigabytes into this laptop. So for two eight gigabyte sticks, okay, it is only $60. So in total, this laptop will be almost $400. And you have a laptop that you can stream straight from your console and you can purchase the Elgato from the app Mercari. Most people are selling them for like $100 or less. So in total, for $500, you will have a streaming setup perfect for you and you have a little bit of money left over to buy a nice 10 20 dollar mic off of amazon all right on to the next laptop the next laptop that i have for you guys is a dell inspiron okay this one is 15.6 inches it is a touchscreen i don't know if people prefer touchscreen laptops it doesn't matter to me as long as i can work with it it's fine this has an intel i3 with eight gigabytes of memory uh one terabyte hard disk drive and a 128 gigabyte solid state drive and this is only $400 okay again I only give you laptops that have Ethernet ports because streaming over Wi-Fi is really iffy okay this has 8 gigabytes of RAM so straight out the box this laptop is gonna be actually perfectly fine for you guys but you are gonna notice a little you know slow up because you have 8 gigabytes of RAM you're gonna have the Elgato you're gonna have the Streamlabs running and you might have a little you know slow down what I recommend, this laptop is also upgradable to 16 gigabytes though, okay? I would recommend getting a 16 gigabyte stick or two 8 gigabyte sticks. Um, I'm not 100% sure about this model, whether it has two slots for the RAM, but if it does, I recommend getting dual channel so you have purchased another 8 gigabyte stick. An 8 gigabyte stick is a roughly $40, like $37 because a four gigabyte stick is anywhere from 20 to 30. It depends on how the market looks like. So with this laptop for $400, again, if you buy the extra RAM stick, that's anywhere from 30 to $40, your price for this will be roughly $450. Okay, depending on what state you live in, if you live in New York, it's gonna be closer to $470. And then you can purchase an Elgato 
and that's gonna bring up still under six hundred dollars for a streaming setup so I recommend purchasing this laptop I don't get any kickback from this so I'm just here to give you some information okay before we get into the last laptop of this video I want to talk about the giveaway there was gonna be a gleam link in the comments down below it's gonna be pinned to the top so click that gleam link do all the stuff that's there also share the gleam link on Twitter and it will help you enter the giveaway okay what you will win is either a gaming mouse which I will purchase off of Amazon and ship it to you this is for the United States um, I cannot really ship overseas and if I do it's gonna take a long time so if you can't get the gaming laptop and you are overseas I will give you a $15 card or a $10 card for a PS4 Xbox Steam uh, switch or your phone if you like iOS games whatever um, yeah all right so let's get into the last laptop so the last laptop is not under $500 but it's only $200 more and you don't have to worry about doing anything extra because this is a gaming laptop okay is it a is a HP laptop it has the AMD Ryzen 5 so the CPU is strong enough to do everything that you need and it has 8 gigabytes of RAM okay it has a dedicated graphics card a GTX 1050 and it has 256, 256 gigabytes of solid-state drive okay now this you can also upgrade the RAM if you would like I believe this model goes up to 32 let me just double check um, this laptop actually goes up to 16 gigabytes of RAM so you can add another RAM stick to this and you can actually if you want to play games on this laptop and stream straight from the laptop to Twitch you can do that perfectly fine I do recommend if you're gonna stream straight from the laptop like playing PC games and then stream to Twitch or YouTube I do recommend adding another 8 gigabyte stick to make it 16 so it doesn't lag on you too much but these are the laptops for you guys I wanted to stress that you do not have to break bank to get a streaming laptop to start off with and I know in these times it's really hard to get even $500 to start streaming but if you are an adult and you were able to get that stimulus check this will help you out and you can start streaming alright guys thank you guys for watching this is AjaxG here peace